It's very important to perform a daily walk around on the machine and visually check for any areas that may require service or scheduled repair. Pay close attention to the condition of rims and tires, inspect the linkage pins, hitch area, and underside of the machine. Located on the back of the machine is the rear vision camera, which can be cleaned while standing inside the rear bumper handrail. Also located on the back of the machine is the cat detect, backup alarm, and VIMS blue light. Also located in the bumper is the jump start receptacle and on this tier four final machine, an amber purge light for diesel exhaust fluid. This light will turn out when the DEF fluid has been purged back to tank. At this time, the operator can turn off the battery disconnect switch. Hydraulic fluid can be checked on the side of the machine using the sight gauge. Transmission fluid level. Checking the transmission fluid level and adding fluid when necessary. Located at ground level, the loader provides locations for fueling and filling the auto loop system. Also located at ground level is the auto loop fill location. If equipped, optional fast fill is also located on the fuel tank. Certain tier four final loaders use diesel exhaust fluid or DEF. The DEF fill location is at ground level. DEF must meet international organization for standardization or ISO 22241-1. The DEF and fuel tank should be filled at the same time. The burn rate of DEF is typically two and a half to 3% of your fuel burn. Located inside the engine enclosure is the engine oil dipstick and fill. The operator can verify oil level by removing the dipstick. An egress ladder is located on the side of the platform on K-series loaders. Cabs are also equipped with alternate exits. Refer to the operation and maintenance manual for specific locations on each model. The upper platform allows the operator to access the engine coolant sight gauge and the door located on top the engine coolant fill. Before operation, always inspect and fasten your seatbelt. 